Here we are at Watkins Glen International for the first race in season one. We're here today for around 10 laps at this exquisite road course. Here are our ones to watch for today. And on pole, William Byron, who is fastest in practice by over half a second, looks to take the win here today at Watkins Glen International. Then we have our last race's winner, Martin Truex Jr., and he wasn't great in practice, but obviously he picked it up in qualifying as he starts fifth here today. And finally, Eric Amarola had a wonderful qualifying today, and with poor previous performances, we've heard from his pit crew that he wants at least a top 10 finish here today as this is one of his best races. But let's get to our starting lineup for today's race at Watkins Glen. Here is our starting lineup going left to right. On pole, we have William Byron next to Alex Bowman. Then we have Joey Logano and Ross Chastain. Behind them is our previous race winner, Martin Shirks Jr. with Eric Almarola next to him. In our fourth row, we have Christopher Bell and Chase Elliott. Securing 9th and 10th place is Brad Kislowski in 6 and Denny Hamlin. After them, we have Michael McDowell in the 34 and Kyle Larson. Behind them is Kyle Busch and Kurt Busch. Behind them, it's Bubba Wallace and a poor performance by Ryan Blaney. Puts him in 16th. After that, we have Daniel Suarez and AJ Allmendinger in the 16. And rounding off the top 20 for today is Kevin Harvick and Corey LaJoy with a new paint scheme. Then we have Chase Briscoe and Austin Sindrick back in 22nd. Then it's Ricky Stenhouse Jr. and Chris Buescher. Finishing 12th in our last race is Noah Gragson next to Austin Dillon. After them is Todd Gilland in his dad's old car with Eric Jones right beside him. And in the back of the pack for today's race is Harrison Burton and the number 21 car. And here they go. They're going to get off of pit lane as we start today's race. Here we go, and we're underway here at Watkins Glen. There goes William Byron into the S's. Bowman right behind him. He goes to the bottom lane. Chastain takes third. They go around the corner, and Elliot into the wall. Logano gives payback. Byron leads lap one. Chastain clears Bowman. He moves up to second. And there's Tyler Reddick. He passes Logano for a nine-spot boost in the first lap. There's William Byron going through. It's lap three now. Almirola in fourth. Oh, no. Byron locks up the brakes. Chastain in the lead. Byron fighting right back. There they go around the corner. Almirola takes third. Oh, no. Logano dumps Bell. He's into the wall. He takes Denny Hamlin with him. Let's look at that again here. As you see, Chastain and Byron fighting. Logano dumps Bell into the corner. He collects Denny Hamlin, and he goes on top. One more time here. As you can see, Logano really had no remorse for taking him out right there. And that's not going to be very fun. Lap six here. And Chastain gets bumped around. Almirola in the lead. Byron in second. Chastain looks to get back into third, but Kislowski's going to take that again. Almirola leads them again. As they go around the corner, Chastain overtakes Kislowski. Here they go, through the bus stop. Around the corner here. And as you see, Tyler Reddick gets bumped by Kislowski. He fights back, shoves him into the wall. But Kislowski clears Tyler Reddick now. 
Now into the bus stop for Amarola, Byron, and Chastain. Chastain overtakes Byron. Can he clear him? Yes. Now he fights Amarola. He takes it. Oh, no. Elliot. Even more payback. He dumps Logano this time. Let's look at that again here. As you can see, Chastain just clears Amarola. And Chase Elliott fights back, takes Logano out, and he takes out Bubba Wallace and Kyle Busch in the process. One more time here. As you can see, Chase Elliott turned Logano and put him into Bubba Wallace, who he spun Kyle Busch. There's Logano, Bubba Wallace, and Kyle Busch. But here we go, lap 10 here. And they go around. It's Chastain who takes a commanding lead, and Tyler Reddick is there as well. Almirola is still in third. Here they go, and Reddick switches lanes. But here they go, lap 10 here, and Reddick pushed by Chastain. He's going to clear Chastain again. Chastain and Reddick fighting on. Who's going to win this? Here they go. William Byron puts Reddick in, threads the needle, and William Byron will win at Watkins Glen. What a race here today. Let's look at that one more time here. As they get into the corner, Chastain bumps Reddick. He goes wide. Reddick fights back. Chastain on the bottom there. William Byron pushes Reddick into Chastain. He gets a flat tire. William Byron threads the needle. Tyler Reddick spins out from the flat tire in the end. But William Byron wins here. Here are our standings. William Byron, of course, wins the race. Ross Chastain takes second. And Tyler Reddick with an amazing third place finish, climbing up from 15th today. Eric Almirola, wonderful road course racer, finishes fourth today. And Brad Kozlowski with a very surprising fifth place finish. Michael McDowell in his first race gets seventh place. And Kevin Harvick, after some bad performances previously, gets 10th place on the run. Here's 11th to 20th. Corey LaJoy with a very surprising 11th place finish today. He was behind Michael McDowell for most of the race, but got wide in the end. Kyle Larson in 12th. Good day for him. Martin Truex Jr. finishes 13th today. He fell off quite a bit. He really went back to his qualifying pace, which wasn't great for him. Chase Elliott from the back of the pack after he had to pit. Finished 14th today. AJ Allmendinger, 15th. He did a lot worse than his third place finish last race at Bristol. Then you have Stenhouse, Sindrick, Gregson in 18th, Todd Gill, and then Chase Briscoe. Rounds off the top 20 for today's race. And here we are, 21 through 29 here. Harrison Burton started last place. Didn't finish last place, but finished last place in the people who actually finished the race. Kyle Busch, very unfortunate day for him. Same for the rest of the people who crashed out. Chase Elliott got the last laugh on Logano there. Christopher Bell was dumped by Logano. And Hamlin got collected in that wreck. But that's about it. Continue signing up. I know it should have ended right here, but anybody who still wants to sign up definitely can. Tell anyone you know or any uh, NASCAR stop motion creators anything. Anybody can still sign up, and we're looking forward to the rest of Season 1 here. And we will see you next time.